Good morning, YouTube family, man. We are in the elevator. I'm about to come out and check out my car for the first time, y'all. I'm pumped. I'm excited, man. I've been waiting a week and a half for this moment. Woo, let's get it, dog. Let's go. Y'all, I'm so excited, man. We here, actually. Hey, check out that little monster right there. Got a challenger right here. Y'all, it's a moment of truth. It is the moment of truth, y'all. Y'all. <laughs> I'm excited for this shit. Let's go, let's go. Y'all, the moment of truth, man. Woo. Oh, there he is. There's a man right there. Stuff is like not even clean. Like I don't like I don't understand how you think like that. Like, do you think that's clean like that? With chrome, you can't bend it into recess areas like that. I it mean, I turn white. Yeah, but look at that. Like, I wish you had told me like it was gonna like you didn't even would. Like it's bubbly everywhere. That's just like bubbly everywhere. All right, but what I'm saying is, you see this scrape right here? Like these lights are scraped. That's a scrape. Yeah. So the whole headlight is now scraped up. You didn't replace this either. Like what happened with this piece? You, 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 see, you see how this is scraped right here? Yeah. Now the whole bumper is scraped. The whole headlight. So, so now I'm basically, this, I have a scraped up bumper. I have no weather stripping on the hood. I got a scraped up headlight. Uh, you didn't even put the fender, the fenders are just showing off. You broke that. Uh, stick the fenders. You couldn't tell me that you basically just like have the whole bumper like ripped. Like, like I paid. So I paid for all this stuff, and then it's like, so you're just gonna take the money. Like this wasn't ripped up like this. It was. It was not, bro. Like it was not this inside like that. It was never like ripped up like that. Like the this, red. This red strip just sitting out like that. I get cut off the I just don't see how this is okay. Like, I mean, this, it was never this ripped up. I have pictures I can prove it was never like that ripped up in there. And then the red, you can see the red thing is in yeah, here. Right now, so I can take it apart and put it back together. Like, I'm just trying to figure out, like, were you just like bullshitting on the time? Like, did you actually take the time to do this? Because this looks, no, yeah. this look, this looks like it, you, you, you could do this type of work in like two days. Like honestly, like I'm not trying to be mean, but like so now I gotta put the emblem on. Is is the emblem in the car too? Yeah. So why didn't you do any? So why didn't you do any of this? Like I don't understand. Like why didn't you, you 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 didn't put the emblem on? You didn't tell me about anything. Like like honestly, like why didn't you say I didn't put the tent that you paid for? I didn't search here. Yeah. The yeah, but what I'm saying is, what were you doing? Like why didn't you put? Why didn't you put anything like? There's obviously more scrapes on this. This all these were not here. Everything's bubbled up. Like, I just don't understand. Like, like that's bubbled up. That's not there. These scrapes weren't there. Like, so you're gonna like honestly, this was your car. Like, would this be acceptable to you? Like, you didn't even, you just did there, but you didn't even do, like, the other part. Like, so that the inside, that's the rubbing from the door. So this fender is even, that, that's not even on right. You can show, you can check the other side if you want to. That's not even on right. So I gotta get fucking the fender. It's supposed to be up to here, because the line's supposed to go straight like that. This is the rubbing from the door before. As you can see, that's the out, outside. It so doesn't mean like, like that side's fine, but this side, obviously, like if that's like that, this shouldn't be like that. So clearly something isn't, see how flush that is? That 2135 I sent you, I want that back in my account today. No, I'm getting that shit now. Thought I'd give you guys a video update. On the car, as you can see, you can see 
this piece he even put the bumper in right he scraped all this this is all now scraped up like that the whole front he didn't reinstall this piece he scraped up the whole bumper all the way there's literally bubbles everywhere the whole car is just bubbled up i'm not sure if that rubbing is from here he didn't even install the kit right he only put one of that one kit on didn't even wrap it the rest he left it's just trash everywhere like there's bubbling here I'm not sure if you guys can even see all this, but it's just bubbles everywhere. Bubbles here, bubbles here, bubbles here, bubbles here, bubbles here, bubbles here, bubbles here. This is all peeling. The whole thing. He didn't even finish wrapping this. Like, like look at this trap. There's not even one solid piece. This is different pieces right here. Gap from where it's gray to it's black. Like. The back decal like this without even putting the decal back on. You can even see here on the back bumper that there's different lines and different pieces. So unprofessional. Look at that. Like that's the fender. Like that's supposed to be like wrapped. Cuts right there. Didn't even put the wide body fender back on. There's a nasty gash right here. You can come in here and see the seams everywhere. Place this piece right here. It's just everywhere. It's just a mess. He didn't even... He didn't even put it back in right. Like, it's loose. It's, it's like that on both sides of the car. The video. I just did a video on my car's lights. As you can see, this halo doesn't even work. This light works. Like that side's messed up and I see this side isn't working right. That run, that daytime running light isn't even on and that halo's on, but like you didn't even install the lights right. Like it's just a mess. This is just unprofessional. Damaged the car in many places. It definitely was not returned to me in the quality condition that I dropped it off at. You even just look at like all this like you put like tape here like it's not one seam like look at this just look at that he had also scratched up a bunch of the carbon fiber parts. I have pictures of the hood to show it was not in this bad a condition. All this is completely scratched up. I'm not sure if you guys can see that, but it's all scratched. I'm not sure if we put something on top of the hood, but also just left a bunch of pieces in the car. Didn't bother to reattach this. Some of my fenders, he completely scraped up. Like this whole fender is just scraped everywhere. I am also missing pieces to the car. My back, all these pieces aren't even in here. There's just pieces missing. Um, so he has also stolen pieces from the car. So he's not only broken things, damaged things, but now he's also stolen things and he has also fled. So the wires are all messed up. Didn't bolt this stuff back in. Both sides. Just hanging, no bolts in here. All right, y'all, so this is the weight that y'all been waiting for for about a week and a half now. To be honest, it's just, it's been a hard month for me. I've been going through a lot, but like I said, when you vlog, you vlog the good and you vlog the bad. Me being a business owner, owning a business and running a business, this is just unprofessional. The gentleman who did the work on this vehicle decided not to give me any type of refund. He is not going to try and reimburse me for this work. 
of this quality and was not being professional car. This person has worked on eight SEMA cars, so he seemed very reputable. He seemed like he did his work. I've seen some of his work in person, but at the end of the day, I pray for everyone. Because in this car community, all we have is each other. All we have is the love that we have for vehicles, for cars, for style, for speed, for everything involving motorsport. And we have each other. Have a good day. Thank you.